All right, what is up, everybody? Boop. All right. Ah. Oh. Okay, I have been busy today. <laughs> and then I'm going to be busy tomorrow and busy the next day. So, um, apologies for the slow start on the stream tonight. Um, something fell and I did not know what the fuck it was. And I was like, shit, the merchandise is failing. Nah, we're good. It was just the plastic lid to the Tupperware container. Yeah. Nah. Got two banana loaves. Banana bread loaves. Um, one of them is being sold after stream tonight, which that means I'm going to be leaving early tonight. So probably like quarter till usual, like 15 minutes until I usually end. That's probably when I'm going to stop. Um, that way I can wrap it and then go find the dude. So, um... Yeah, and then I've got a loaf in their bread machine that's going to be turned into croutons. Oh my god, Kita, no. 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 Nothing for you. Nothing for you. Nope. Nope. Um, and then... Laundry and dishes. That was my, that was my adventure for the day. Woke up at seven, no, six o'clock. So I can make sure that Vic didn't leave anything behind. That was fun. And then I felt super sick. And I was like, dear God, I'm probably getting sick. I'm probably going to have, you know, an issue. Went to bed, everything was fine. So we're good. I'm not dying yet. Thank you. So yeah. And then I've got my schedule up for tomorrow so that I don't get overwhelmed. No, I don't want to spit the germs. So yeah, um... Still don't know if we're even doing vampire tomorrow. I don't know. Let's ask how laser if we're still on on for that or like just see if anybody's actually going to show up besides Darth. You're still working on mom's room? Wait, did I not get the tap groups? What the fuck? Oh. He's fighting a bee. Also, I was going to do World vs. World for the night, but since after stream last night, we went to the grocery store and we saw our friend who was just like, why don't you sell me bread anymore? And we're like, what the fuck do you want? I mean, you have to tell us if you want bread so we can make you the bread. And he was just like, I'll take a banana. And then I was like, all right. <laughs> So, but he doesn't get off until 11 o'clock at night, so night shifters, where you at? I know your pain. <laughs> right? And it's not like, you know, he doesn't see it. We see him damn near almost every single day. So it's like... He's cool, though. He's fun. <clears throat> Vic actually knows him from a previous job, and then he changed careers, basically, and he's a security guard at night, so it's pretty chill. He's weird, but everybody is. All the cool people are, but yeah. Oh, 
<sighs> Ugh, coffee's brewing. Yeah, so I wake up at seven. No, six o'clock today, right? Because Vic had to be out the door by seven. <clears throat> I know, just God. So I, after he had left, I started to feel really nauseous and cold. So I had to go and get the meats from the meat shop before they ran out because that apparently they are. They're waiting for a delivery, so whatever they have, it's kind of going until, you know, they get the delivery, so people are, like, buying it. So I had to make sure I showed up early as fuck for that. So I got that. Um, and then, yeah, I came back home, and I was, I, I felt like I was dying. I was like, I do not feel good. I was underneath three blankets, and that is a lot coming from me. So, I was like, all right. <clears throat> but after, you know, I went back to bed, I got warm eventually. Everything was good. Yeah, no. It was, I think it was just because of really shitty sleep. I think it's because, like, I have been getting some really, really horrendous sleep lately. So. At least that's what I'm going to blame it on. Probably just caught up to me. But I have my my menu planned out for Sunday. We're going to be doing a lot. <laughs> so Saturday I've got an order for cinnamon rolls with the meat shop people. And she pays. I mean, I'm not going to say no, but you know, they pay. So, so I have to have that by noon on the Saturday. So Sunday I've got another batch of cinnamon rolls because a very nice lady came by and she's like, you don't have your cinnamon rolls today. And I'm like, no, because they don't, they don't really sell well. I mean, they, it's like a, if somebody asks for it, yeah, I'll make it. You know, it's made to order, but I mean, I'm not going to be keep making them and then, you know, selling two out of 12. That's, I'm losing money on that. So, and that's something that I can't really like go and like, offload it to other people because other people usually like the apple ones better but anyway so she's like i will buy six so i'm like straight i'll, I'll make i'll make a cinnamon roll batch and six of them go to you so so we got cinnamon rolls that's going to be there we got banana bread which there's a loaf i made too because i went to go buy bananas at the grocery store because they have been having them on sale and they were really yellow and if you've ever made if you've ever made banana bread the more brown they are the better because that means you put less sugar into it because you get more of that natural banana flavor it's it's a yeah well <clears throat> i need we need to make a, a sign of requests like you know whatever but I'm glad that people ask. But anyway, so going back to the banana bread. So they... <sighs> the bananas were gone. Well, they weren't gone, but they were really green. Like, these are like kitty kinds of green. And I'm like, I can't make banana bread with these. Like, I just, I can't. So... Then I'm like, all right, well, I've got like three other places or four other places that I can go check for bananas and like their stuff. No, you cannot do banana bread with green bananas. It does not. No, it's gross. You can't do it. So, um, there was, there's a little pop-up market stand on one of the, the side roads 
or the residential roads, I should say. And um, they're usually there, but they are not there. They were not there today. Ah, that's fine. And then there was um, a permanent store that sells fruits and vegetables. And they had a sign that said, two kilos for 30 pesos. And I was like, do you have yellow bananas? <laughs> and they did. They were, they're like, I would say that was like the minimum of yellowness I would take. Um, I did taste one and it was good. I did have to put in the full or just a little bit short of the full cup of sugar though, because you know, I got to kind of compensate for that shit. But <clears throat> so that was my banana adventure for the day. So yeah, but now I've got two, well, less than two kilos of bananas, but that's why I made another banana bread loaf because, and if it doesn't sell on Sunday, well, guess what? We get a banana bread for the week. Kind of hoping it doesn't sell because that means, mm, nah, <clears throat> nah, I go a little bit under because that shit gets really sweet. Oh yeah, no. <laughs> um, so yeah, so we've got cinnamon rolls, banana bread, the usual empanadas um, of apple, and then we got the picadillo, which that one we've been starting to introduce and it's, it's doing well, actually. Um, Rice Krispies, so that's one, two, three, four, that's five items. Um, and then I've got, I got a loaf in the bread machine that's going to be for croutons. That's number six. I have to make the croutons tonight. And then tomorrow I'm going to do a loaf to sell. I'm actually starting to get people who want to buy those, which is nice. And then I'm going to test one. Um, it is a bacon tomato bread loaf. I am really intrigued. I have no idea if that's going to work or not, but we're going to find out. Because we had tomatoes. I don't remember if you were if you guys were here or if you recall, but a couple of weeks ago we had bought a shit ton of tomatoes and they were starting to go out because we did not store them properly. So I was able to salvage a lot and then I turned them into dried or dehydrated tomatoes and then I packed them in oil and some other stuff. So yeah. So we've got some of that that's going to go into this because apparently that's what it uses along with some other stuff. Makes me happy makes me happy. I really enjoy making things for people to like buy or eat or whatever. Usually because I like to see what, you know, like the they like them. So I was this close to buying pumpkin, but I had to stop myself. I want to get this done. I'm so close to mixing this up. I do know that Vic has requested that I make the homemade noodles. And we have a butt ton of eggs right now. Which our the recipe that we had growing up takes like six goddamn eggs. I'm gonna cut that shit in half, but it, it takes a lot of eggs. It's an egg noodle. Homemade egg noodles. And we're going to see if anybody likes those. Those also freeze really well. And since our freezer seems to be freezing lately. Oh, we also, we also found another place that we can purchase a refrigerator. <clears throat> Do 
<laughs> oh, so for my birthday, right? Well, I know that I had told Kitty about this adventure. Um, trying to get one of those Beetlejuice Beetlejuice cups from Domino's the second time. That one was not fun. That experience was horrible. But, you know, we got it. So that was... We did... We both had a great weekend. So that was like our victory pizza. I don't know. Like, I don't know. Like, it's like a reward. <laughs> like... I had a good selling weekend. Vic had a good work weekend. We're just like, yeah, we'll get a pizza. And since they got the promotion going on for Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice with a little um, a special glasses, there was one that I still wanted, so we had to go get that. I'm not even going to go into the detail about that shit because it was some bullshit, but I got it in the end. So I guess that was like also yay birthday. And then... We went to fishy sticks and mashed potatoes. That sounds good. Um, and then we went to Panda Express. This was on Wednesday. Because Panda Express has... They they have like little promotions that they put out, right? Like little posters. And it says Mondays you can get a panda bowl for 89 pesos. Which is like... It's under $5. We'll go with that. And we were like, okay, that's cool. And then underneath it, there's little writing that says you have to do it through the app. And we were like, all right, fine. You know, fuck it. We'll go and do it in the app. Yeah, they don't have an app. Apparently it's in beta testing. And we didn't know that until we asked one of the workers. And it's like, bitch, you could have fucking told us that. So yeah, there was that. Um, but on Wednesdays, they have three for two. So Vic was just like, well, don't you want it? I'm just like, nah, man, I'll just wait until Wednesday. Because, I mean, if we're going to get a panda bowl each, one for you, one for me, might as well wait for Wednesday so you get a free panda bowl with your purchase. And... With Panda Express, um, we have something that's called um, like Gomer Club, which when you um, sign up for it, they ask you for your birthday and they give you something for free. And um, for me, I don't know if it's the same for everybody, but you get um, 250 grams of a dish for free on your birthday or for the month of your birthday. So, orange chicken. And it's like a small little box like this. But honestly, it's enough to give you a little bit of extra something. It's it's actually kind of nice. So, you don't have a Panda Express near you? That sucks. So, yeah, that was, that was my actual birthday meal that was postponed by a day. Because, fuck. <laughs> Um, yeah, that was about it. And then I bought some yarn. And if you haven't seen the, uh, the picture on Discord, you'll see what I needed that yarn for. That shit's cute. Ah... What the fuck you- Hey, hey, you know what? Here, I'll show you, kitty, since you're here. Where is it? You see this right here? This is that precursor for the pony bow. That one is have, has your name on it. That is for your birthday. I've got this, and I've got this. I just need to do some other stuff, but that's waiting for you. Get your ass in the game, goddammit. Yeah, I think it's just a Mexico thing. But yeah, you can shoot ponies. And we can go shoot ponies together. But yeah, this is waiting for you. This has your name on it. Mostly because I'm waiting for 
my other one to sell. This one's, I'm still waiting. It's getting there. It's getting there. That one's mine. I'm a patient person. Especially when it comes to something like that. That's a big purchase. <sighs> but anyway. fuck do you find the keys for this anyway? Anyway. That makes me give me a second. Gonna make sure in 30 minutes I need to make sure that I'm with the Warframe thingy. Because Warframe has their announcement stuff tonight. Yeah, that's the only downside about having like somebody with the same birth month. I should know, Kitty and I, we had to share our birthdays. <laughs> that is alright. Oh man, McDonald's. Hey man, ours isn't bad. Ours isn't bad. <laughs> I know. I know. I want to get this heart done. God damn it. I'm so close. I am getting out of the zone for the hearts. We actually passed by the sushi, one of the sushi places, and I was like, oh god, if Kitty was here. Especially since I found out that one of them has two for one on Tuesdays. And I was like, son of a bitch. I can't do stuff like that. Like, I have to get, like, single, single stuff. I can't finish off one of those things by myself. I get the two and then what remember our refrigerator doesn't work like a hundred percent of the time and we have to like it's gonna be frozen or very very cold sushi True. That is a thing, yeah. But anyway. Frozen sushi?
I think I got it done, but I'm going to do one more just to make sure. Interesting. <clears throat> nope, okay, it did not. Now I did. Alright, well we finished another one. It is fucking cold as shit here today. Alright, my home studying is done. I have that completely done. I think this was the next one that we were doing? Let's go look at the stuff. We're taking a break. Yeah. I need to go find my one on. I think I'll put warm socks on again because this shit's cold. This house is cold. It's the only problem about having concrete walls and brick walls is that the cold comes and hits you. Give me another minute because the coffee's done. Hold on. Hold on. Your love. I mean, don't get me wrong. I would rather be cold than hot because with cold you can add layers. When it comes to the heat, you know, just short of peeling off your skin, <laughs> like there's there's a certain limit, you know. <laughs> Look at all the little pumpkins over here. I gotta add all that stuff too. Fuck. So we got that heart done. I've got my home studying finally maxed out, so that's good. We've got some of these to do. Um, 
me take a nice warm cup of coffee. Mm. God, yes. Kita, you ate all of those treats that Kitty sent. Okay, you have some of the broken ones. Here. <clears throat> I know she does. She always does. So I'm going to be honest, I have fallen off of my, my train that I was, you know, started off of the year and it was after I went to the USA to help Kitty. I just have not been able to get back on that horse and I'm trying, I'm trying, but at this point in time, at this point in time, I've switched gears and I've been trying to make things that I can sell at on my Sunday bake sales because yeah, I'm, I'm doing more physical stuff. I need to get back into doing guides for this and I want to, and I'm wanting to get back on it before the end of the year. If it's going to happen or not, I don't know. But along with that, I don't know if you guys remember, but we were supposed to be doing a, doing a Guild Wars one activity every month. For those of you who, you know, either wanted to revisit Guild Wars 1 or if you have never played it and you want to go through Guild Wars 1 to work on some stuff. I don't know what happened to that. I mean, but we're still doing our Warframe someday, so that's fun. I feel like this year was just a lot of shit happened to a lot of people and things just fell off. Because at the beginning of the year, Vic, Hellraiser, and I, Kitty, you were still included in that, but you just kind of never showed interest, was supposed to be working on a TTRPG. And the info dump is there. It's been exposed, and we've talked about it, kind of, and then that was it. Um, there's the Bite Vortex that I have been working with Hellraiser on. And that stopped, I think, in April. So just there's a lot of things that... And I was doing my guides. I haven't been able to get back onto that. It's just, I think... Yeah, no, it was just... Yeah, I think just this year was kind of a, fl uh, a flurry of what the fuckness is. And then I had to step back from doing Vampire the Masquerade as, like, being a DM. <clears throat> and then shit happened with that. Nobody's fault on that. You know, you, death is, you know, inevitable. Like, shit happens. I mean, I don't want to say it like that, but I'm, like, the worst person to talk about emotional shit. Anyway, <clears throat> so... That one ended, and then I know that we've been trying to kickstart it again, but the interest is gone. So. <sighs> yeah, I think at the rest of the year, because we're coming up at the close of September here. And that means October, November, December. That's three months, and maybe three months to get our shit in order so that we can kick off next year with a bang. Maybe. I don't know. That's me just talking out loud. All right. No problem, kitty. Tell mom I said hi. Ooh, more diving goggles. Oh, 
Oh, I did get this one. Fuck. <laughs> yeah, man. If she wants to go through boxes, pop the woman go through boxes. What's this? This looks like a gun. Why is there a gun mounted to the, uh, what? What are we shooting at from here? Is the waterfall dangerous? <laughs> Spooky waterfalls. <laughs> oh. And then I know that I'm having to learn how to do stuff by myself because Vic has his job now and he's gone almost, almost every single weekend. So that's the thing. Can't complain though, as long as he gets paid. Ah, oh, coffee. Mm. Something up here. All right. The only thing that I enjoy about adulting is that basically, a, you have your own responsibilities, which also can be the downside. But you get adulting money. And you can do whatever the fuck you want with adulting money. For the most part. I mean, obviously you do have, you know, things that you have to do, you know, like pay bills. But if you have extra adulting money, you don't have a parent saying, no, you don't need that. I don't know how that is. Okay, it's that one. We're dancing with the teddy bears. I have done this four times. I am now on tier two. Jeez. This is gonna take some time. Actually, not really. I just have to make sure I come in every day and do this. Ah, oh, all right. 
I'm going to undo that one. Um, that's honey and flower, but where do you buy the keys? That's the question. Okay, it works. What's that? Done on. I made a sound. Alright. Okay, let's see. Warframe stream started. I refresh this. I'm gonna put it over here. All right. I'm not gonna have an audio on it for you know, mute, but I can at least see parts of it. So. All the recipes are known for that. Sweet treated pine plank. Say five times fast. Okay, well, let's sell some stuff here. Um... What does that give me? Okay. Something made sounds. Okay. Is all I'm going. It, it, it's also been raining all day. We get like a break for a little bit and then right back to rain. How cold is it? Fifty-seven freedom units. Oof. So it's raining all day Sunday. I'm still gonna show up. I'm still gonna fucking show up. It's cold. Alright. Really wish I, I mean, I think we still have like a clear plastic that I can put on top of the table and just sit outside with an umbrella. Should be fine. gonna be a rough Sunday. 
I'm probably going to be the only person out there. Oh well. The hustle is real. Okay, so you only pick up one at a time. This sucks. Death to the shroom! Death to the shroom! I guess I didn't pick it up. Whoa, that's a special mushroom. Interesting. Okay. I just want to put in one more. God. Apparently I can't find one more mushroom to give. Let's push it. There we go. A nice little mushroom farm right there though. Die, shroom, die. The Mushroom King, huh?
charges, pulls in foes, stomps on heads, explodes on death. Damn. Shroom, 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 shroom. They finally kicked over Warframe. All right, I got that done. Oh yeah, no, I'm not going to get this thing done.
Mira. See what I can do. Also, I need to go get my my gathering. <laughs> oh god, it's so cold. actually get some some different tunes going all right so this is entirely unlocked now then what did somebody outside say some shit to you? Hmm? She's like, yes. Wear a candlestick. Bonfire, yes. <laughs> Basic grave marker. Oh man, we can make two of those. Alright. I wonder how far out you can go in here. We'll find out. It's not what oh is this one. Oh, you gotta put a glyph in there. Oh, that sucks. Balls. Alright. So I still need to touch these things then. wonder actually uh, I was thinking I might have an extra glyph but I don't and I got the ones on my character and then I've got the 
I'm glad I glyph on that. Hmm. Wait, did the pearls get picked? They did. Oh, okay, okay. All right, so how much is a glyph of alchemy then? expensive probably yeah no I am not gonna pay 199 for that ouch New Warfare looks like fun. Alright. Well, that's unfortunate. I guess... I guess that's a good way to see if I... Like, until I can get an actual glyph to put into that. Or if I have little to no time. I mean, I guess I could always use it that way, too. No man, I like I like my additional glyphs glyph hits. October third is the next Warframe update. Shit. All right. I write that one down. Someone's like, I was expecting November. Yeah, I was too. But October, or like towards the end of October, but so early for October. Jesus. That's awesome. Mm.
I wanted to step away here a little bit to check on some things that I'd started before stream. So I need to check on the bread machine, make sure that that is still working. I need to go change out the uh, trays for the onions that I'm dehydrating. And I need to see if those things are done cooling down. I'm gonna, what's up, Orion? I'm gonna go see how far this goes. How are you enjoying the new stuff for Guild Wars 2, by the way? can't touch oh oh shit you can actually go over here to a point okay That's actually a really big home instance. I didn't think it was this big. Wonder, can you actually like build underwater too or no? Nah? Probably not. Damn. This is massive. This is something that we've been asking for for a long time. <laughs> Holy crap. And you get access to this. Oh man, I've got ideas. I've got a crap ton of ideas to implement into this. I'm wondering if they'll, like, give you different homestead options, like, kind of like with guild halls when they introduce those. I mean, they should have just stuck with the original guild rooms. One, guild halls. Or... Wow, you have your own little portals. That's so cool. All right, be right back. I need to go. I'm not going to change over to the AFK screen, but I need to go do some stuff real quick. So just give me a second.
it's changed out onions. Banana bread is nice and cool. So probably like another hour. Probably have to be right back screen and wrap that so I can deliver. Alright, so we have mastered at home studying. That is definitely there. Um, I mean, in the end, I want to max out all of these. So, uh, coding cash keys are from Queen Collectors. You know, reading might help if I actually read that shit. So, okay. This is what I want to get. The barricade harvesting techniques. And then obviously that one. So yeah. And then the work club mounts. I'm just. That's going to be the last one I do. So. Okay. So we shall go just do events after events after events. Let's see how if I can actually max out some of these things today. Whoa, something up there. That is not for this. <laughs> oh god, okay. Get him.
It's so cold here that the coffee is so it, it, it went cold. It went cold way faster than I'm used to. Oh my god. It's gonna be one hell of a fucking winter. You don't have to winterize the house. You have to look into making thermal curtains or something. Skin, gut, salt, dry. Woo woo. Let's go. Grab that. Skin the fish. Scoop. Squishy. Salt. Oh god, I could go for some nice salty fish. A nice bass or like a denapio or something like that. Mm. He's down.
That's done. No, this one, I don't think I've actually succeeded this. It says, destroy the pollutants and cover yourself in rots and get examined by the ward. I can destroy this shit, but I don't know exactly where to get examined because it doesn't... I don't know. Not that way. Okay, so it actually, okay. No wonder I've never been able to do it before. There goes all my minions. Well, that's not going to get done. At least I participated. Now I know how to do it. Apparently I was typing something. <laughs> Red and Gale, where are we going?
Something about the Smita? Oh, is this the final companion rework? Okay. Yeah, they are reworking the companions. Oh, this is good. This is good, good. Oh, that makes me happy. I'm gonna have to redo that guide. <laughs> Ah, oh, bitch. I'm going to have to like, read all about this stuff, but so far I'm liking what I'm seeing with the Warframe stream that's going on. <clears throat> okay. We're behind that. This looks good. This looks real good. Nice. Alright. Five new incarnons, Sestra, Dara, Okina, Sakaris, and Sabaros. Okay. I know like two of those. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. well, DE's been doing a bang up job. That's impressive. See this invasion mission, new resources. Oh, that's where we're going to be farming. Okay. I mean, see, this has been needing a, I think, for a bit. So that's good. What relics are going to show owned and craft status? So it's not just a me thing. I didn't honestly didn't know if that was in or not. Do, 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 do. Cross-platform updates. Okay. 
Okay. Eligible accounts can trade and gift between all platforms. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. Whoops, flies, drinks, blood. Oh shit, that was a mastery point. Nice. Well, we got another one. Collect for oh Frogger and is in game now, yep. This is a fun one. If you're familiar with the Frogger game. Let's see how well I do this time. Nope. I already missed, okay. Oh, you can't get on your skimmer for this. Oh, they thought about everything for that, huh? It's a whole lot of frogs. <laughs> No, fuck. Ah, it's because I'm rushing. I don't want to get this done or not.
Oh, no. Ah, oh, so close. Wait, can I throw the frog at the pot? Oh, nice. How far can I throw that? Okay, not that far. No. Ah, shit. Nope. Fuck. Oh, man. That's a fun one, though. Okay, that was cool. Nobody's going after that champ, I've noticed. I keep expecting to find something down here, but I don't know if I'm just not seeing it. But there's a POI that's up top, but like, I can't figure out how to get to it, so I was always thinking that maybe, maybe there's something down here, like a, a hidden entrance or something. I don't know. Bog bodies.
I see a tree over there, but we'll go do this first. Ah, they finished it. Alright, Warframe is done with now. Some pretty cool things that I saw were announced. Is this tree? There it is. Ah, oh, what's this one? What's the champ shark? I want to be right back. I go pull the bread out. Of that's never going to cool in time for me to do croutons later. So maybe we can get more people for the shark. So I'll be right back. I'm in the middle of doing baking stuff. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
<laughs> I had to go pull the um, Italian herb and garlic out of the bread machine so it can cool down. Hmm. Nobody is here for the shark. Okay. Well, let's go to the main hearts. So I've already gotten one done for the day, I think. No, I've gotten two for, for, done for the day. Let's go to the third one. This is going to be a busy weekend for me. <laughs> and it's going to be rainy. Just hope to God it's not raining on Sunday, like... <laughs> oh, yeah, no. I... Yeah. It's because I haven't changed the music yet, and I'm just like, I'll just be AFK real quick, so... I'm just being lazy. Also, it's cold as fuck, bro. I think we're going to have a pretty chilly winter. I have meat. I don't know what to do with said meat. I've got, hey man, at least the banana bread is done, and that's actually cooled down. I'm just going to have to wrap that up and go deliver it. Oh, this thing's following me all over the place.
You can actually do the same one. Uh, there is a cooldown. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna have to look into making some thermal curtains finally, because we have barely made it in the past. This is gonna be colder than fuck all. All right, heart is done. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Trust me, I know what's gold. <laughs> but, um... Two years ago, I think at this point, um... I have no idea where the fuck it went. I'm gonna have to find it. I did a draft thing because... We live in an old ass house, right? So our front door, there's a decent gap on the bottom that we have to plug up with either a towel that we don't give a shit about or the draft thing that I had made and I have no idea where that went. Although, oh no, we threw it away because I made it so well <laughs> that we were stuck inside the house and we couldn't open the door. Oh, man. So I was like, I'll just redo it next time. Could not get out of the house. Like, legit. We were pulling and pulling and pulling that door. <sighs> so yes, you can make too good of a thing. All right, well, we got that done, so we shall travel northwards. Go work on those hearts. <clears throat> but I do know that, obviously, these curtains are thin as shit, so there's, like, nothing protecting from anything on that. Um, we also have to replace the blinds, but I'm thinking we might upgrade it to, um, oh, what are they called? I mean, there's still blinds, but they're made out of wood. Vic found a, a way to do it, but that would help keep some of the heat in because these things are falling apart. So it's really cheap plastic blinds that, you know, as more that you use it, they start snapping off on the sides. Um, I 
So there's that. And I know that's over in the living room. Those curtains are so old that they have been damaged by just how old they are that they're starting to fray from all of the UV light and stuff that, you know, hits those windows. Because, like, I don't even know. They're, like, at least 20 years. So, I have to replace those. I've been wanting to. Also, I don't think we're still using, like, the OG window panes. So that probably doesn't help. Also, we are slowly repainting the roof. The white seal sealant instead of the red. The red is the one that keeps in the heat. The white one, not so much. But we can't fucking do shit because right now it won't stop raining. Nah, it only comes in two colors, white and red. It's a particular type of paint that's also waterproof, or it repels water, I should say. And we need it to stop raining so that, like, for 40 air, wow, 48 hours so that, you know, our roof can stop leaking. We had fixed the previous leak. And now there's another one. It's because we didn't do the full roof last time. We needed to the full roof. Oh, yeah. Yeah, those rolling blinds. I have a pattern for those, but I don't think Vic trusts me. I don't know. He's weird. I'm like, oh, I want to put curtains up in this, and, you know, it would be nice. And he was like, no. Nah. I'm like, okay. Blackout curtains are always a nicety. 
even if you don't have them like if you did the rolling blind as a blackout curtain you that means that you can have that and then you can have like actual other curtains so that if you don't want to use the blackouts you'll have another option if that makes any sense like you can have multiple different types of sets you can have the ones that roll and then you can have the ones that like just your traditional curtains <sighs> Like right now we have, we got three leaks. So we fixed the ones that were in the living room. There's a leak that is over by our front door, except that one is coming through, a, it's coming along the electrical pipe. So we can't turn that light on. Um, he's gone up to the roof to see like what the fuck is going on because that one was weird. But at least it's not ruining the ceiling, so. So there's that one. We had to unplug. We had to screw off the um, light bulb and put a piece of tape over the switch so that we don't accidentally flip it. <laughs> um, there's the one that's in the bathroom. That one, we're not quite sure where that leak is coming from. Because he fixed it, but apparently that's not, he was like, I don't know if that's actually it or not. Apparently it's in a weird location. So there's that one. And then there's one in his room that started up. So. I do know that this, the window sill in the living room, or one of them, we have two, but one of them, Rakita has her bench, that thing needs some, some care taken into it because it's starting to chip. <clears throat> what the fuck is a jerga, by the way? Or is that like the the cloth, the, the rag that everybody uses here to do mopping? Is that what it's actually called? I have no idea. Actually, I think it would be pronounced Yerga, but... I'm at full gringo there. Also, door to the patio, that thing needs to be replaced. That thing has seen some better days. It's starting to rust on the bottom. <laughs> okay. We have recently changed ours. We have thrown ours of the old one away. We still need to purchase a new one. But in the meantime, my mom had crocheted a bunch of like Swiffer things, and that's what we're using in the meantime. Although Vic is like, we really need to get one so that we can do a nice, good, thorough cleaning. I'm just like, well, go get the fucking thing. Go buy it. How? Anyway. Herga, okay. Okay, we're going with that. Okay. I am not quite sure how to pronounce it with the with the J. That's why I was like, okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. Herga. Oh, now I can go to the. Oh, what is it? The hardware store. 
Instead of just pointing and being like, it's there. Or it's there. Stuff on the little fires. Stumpy, stumpy, stumpy. Oh god, I don't want it to be raining on Sunday. Like it could rain in the after like late afternoon, that would be great. Most of it guess I got those cute pumpkins and I wanted to show I wanted to show people my cute little pumpkins that I made. I still have to assemble these and give them my balls, but Yeah, I mean, you're like, you're right along a major roadway, right? Yeah. I have been enjoying my adventures with sewing lately. <laughs> I'm just hoping that Vic lets me do stuff like sewing some nice thick curtains or something like that. Because the ones that I made here, they need to be obviously on an actual proper thing because I have them mounted onto arrows for my bow. They did an actual rail for that shirt.
They said that the Leviathan was starting, but the Leviathan, like, I don't think that they actually murdered it that fast. The thing's a champion for sure. A legendary at that. I think it's a legendary. Could be wrong. It's big and it takes quite a while to take it down. I don't know. My fingers are cold. <laughs> oh, God. This one's got three hearts. That one's done. Collect jars, fill them with lightning because that works, right? In IRL.
green to them it does okay Why is my contribution net going up? Oh, you have to click the fill bottle and then, oh my god, okay. You have to do two things, not just stand in the circle. Oh, isn't that nice to know? No, just in case again, I'll get struck by lightning twice. Oh no, not the wolves! It's that one that's done. This one I need to go back to. Ah, oh, come on. Seriously? Okay, I'll just fly down there. Jerk. So I need to find any events that's going on in this area. Ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit.
I need to use the bathroom. So I'm put myself over here. Oh my god, never mind. I can do this real quick. I can hold it. All right, now I'm going to go back over here, and then I will push the AFK button for that one. Because I don't know if you guys can hear that toilet flush, and I honestly don't want to ever find out, so. We are back. I going to give you some attention and now you just take treats. You know, want the treats? Want the treats? You are so precious, you know that. And you're warm. No. Oh, we're so snuggling tonight. 
Oh yeah. Nice warm dog. Have another broken piece. There you go. You got 20 minutes before it's dinner time. <clears throat> pink moa, green moa, blue moa. Wait, pink moa, green moa, blue moa bird. Oh, okay. Seriously, look. Pink moa, green moa, blue moa bird. <laughs> Ah, oh, man. Um, Kim Task. I don't even know what the fuck Kim Tasks are in this area for. I see some Mithril Lord, though. Let's go or you can wait twenty minutes. Actually, it's nineteen now, but you can wait. You can wait. Yes, you can. Yeah. Because if I can wait, you can wait. Mm-hmm. That's how this works. Yes, yes, little miss. <laughs> what do you want? Do I have to deal with? Do 
I know, I know. Your head is so warm, dog. What? Oh, you don't even have your blanket. Oh my god. Oh my god. That's probably she's probably like, what the shit? What the shit? Where is my blanket? Oh my god. Hold Such a bad, bad omen. There you go. Oh my god, how could I do that? You're not getting dinner any sooner, but you got your blanket. This is for a different heart. Come. This one's kind of like a smaller area. For this heart. I mean, this does give a little bit of progress, apparently. Just killing these things, but not near enough. Well, I just need more events, but this one's, like, out of all the other places, this one's an entirely small heart area. Like, it doesn't even go across the pond.
I thought that said wild cabbage meat at first, but it was a uh, overlay. I was like, what the fuck is wild cabbage meat? I was very confused. This one hat. This, yeah, this is the faction. Is this the guy with the coins? No. Gifts of craftsmanship, Jesus. This is the coin. So is this the one that would get the keys? So weapons. Ooh, what do these look like? Okay. That's not bad. Uh -huh, ha ha Curious Mersat currency. Where the shit did I get 56 of those? Alright, hold up. Where does that come from? Jan Thier Sentry Strong Box. Well, that's where we're at. Oh. Okay. So you get them from doing some events. Um, you get some from doing some masteries. And that's what you purchase from the NPCs from the Karma. Okay. We got ten. I'm not quite sure if I'm going to be enjoying the rewards out of it, so... Almost done with this. We'll kill some wolves. Again. Nope. 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 Run away! What is that? Oh, someone's doing a rift!
I got zero percent participation with that. Like, is it actually the Leviathan this time, or...? People just calling that shut out, because they can. There's no way in hell these guys are taking it down that fast. In two minutes? Nah. Is there a timer for this? I think people just say that crap and then nothing happens. No, it's actually dead. Dude, what the fuck are they murdering that thing with? Two minutes and that thing's down. Less than two minutes. Fuck. Apparently the groups that I've been with, we don't hit for shit, okay? Thought that thing was a little bit harder to kill, but I guess not. That's drifting out to sea. <laughs> Yeah, no, there it goes. I'm calm bullshit then. Alright. <clears throat> Let's go do this last one. And then...
But Gilmer, White Mantle does nothing for the heart. Which is some bullshit! Probably because it'd be real fast getting that heart done, I guess. I don't know. Ooh, sample grades. That, I think, is an event, isn't it? It's not an event. Okay, because the only time I've ever really noticed that was when there was an event that was running in. Hmm. Today I learned. Okay, you know what? <laughs> Wait, so is this one I can stack? Because it disappears. Hold on. It keeps track of them. Okay. Then why can some of the other ones don't do that? I guess they just never factor that in. Things are going to come back soon. Okay, so this is still associated with an event. 
Maybe. Uh, I guess after this concludes, if it's still there, then I don't know. Oh, there was more down here. No, nope. I'll stop there and I'll let those guys do that. I don't know. Fuck up their chance of getting it done. Falling death path's good. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I think that's all three hearts done. There's only three, so... I just got like two more mastery points? From what? Oh, okay. So I guess I hit that one. What was the other one? Huh, okay. Sweet. I am close to leveling this one up, so let's go find another events cabbage really need to f do a lot of legendaries i know that but i wanted to get my spear done for obvious reasons and i wanted to get my staff done The staff I'm not going to have it with because I don't like the, the looks of the staff or the Gen 1 staff. Well, at least it'll be a legendary and it would be done. Also have the precursor. Bitch. 
Oh, come on. Get off me. Let's go get those meats over here. So I get this. All the little pigs here. Come on. All right, that's done. That's done. There's a thing going on. Oh, see, kill lots of stuff. Someone said it's kill lots of stuff. Oh, never mind. I know that mission. It's the one that's over here. I'm sure that goes crazy. That one, they dropped fairly fast. I think so. Attack. Yep. Did not not up fast enough.
I'm gonna do some of those charged titan ores, which I think is good because I think that's something I need for homesteading, since that's like a new thing. I have to do my research still. I was thinking about the time. I should still be okay. Someone is pinging an event. We're going to go find out. Ruin Shard of Scuttler. He's got ads. He's got ads. Let's work. Let's work some of those ads. There we go. Nice. Bzzz. Ooh, 
was that? I'll get that person up, but I gotta take care of this first. Oh, fuck. That's a death sentence. Can you go in there? Fuck that shit! I just want the rich and mithril vein at this point. God. Oh, that's crazy. Oh my god, there's another two. How oh, is this thing not dead yet? Okay. Holy shit. This area is death. <laughs> this is... Oh, that actually may be worth opening these. Huh. Hmm. 
Interesting. <gasps> oh god. Ooh, okay. Mm. I think I see a portal way out yonder. God's coming to get me. Alright, so I've gotten all of the hearts done for the day. I mean, it's going to take some time since I'm not playing this every single day, but that's fine. I mean, I actually got Home studying done, which that was nice. I pushed the button. Oops. And you, that's a huge area that they give you. That really is. I did not expect that, like, at all. So, props to Anet for that. And then I just need this one to max out. So then, this will be 13. 18, I need 18 more, so pretty much this is going to max that out, and then I'm going to be stuck trying to get the War Club not done. But, I still have to go into these. Ugh. <clears throat> I need to just sit down and do those. Because I got the everything up to the Path of Fire, but Icebrug, End of... Icebrug? Icebrood, End of Dragons, I really need to finish this one too. I didn't really spend a lot of time in End of Dragons, honestly. I think I was actually kind of disappointed. Because I really, really, really enjoyed Factions. And when End of Dragons was announced that, oh yeah, basically we're going back to, you know, Factions land. And I was like, awesome. And then, yeah. The disappointment kind of dropped. I mean, it was cool to see some of the things that they, you know, kept, but at the same time, I was, yeah, I was, I was disappointed. I'm not sure exactly why I was disappointed. I wanted to see Old Kinding. I wanted to see it. And yeah, it says drowned, but it's like, I still wanted to see it. Also, like, where are all of, like, the, the the sewers and all of that stuff? Like, you don't even get to access any of those things. It's like they did away with them. Because some of those things are pretty cool, especially the dungeons. I mean, it was cool to go back into here because, you know, Kurzix. And, you know, seeing some of this stuff, but just, I don't know. It felt... It felt meh. It really felt meh. And I'm hoping that maybe we can go and get more content down here. Maybe. But... I mean, it was the same thing with Path of Fire. Like, it's like, oh my god, we get to go and revisit. And... Uh, Path of Fire was a little bit more entertaining, though. Well, expectations, I guess, just got down anyway so I'm actually going to exit here for the night um, I know it's early I said I was gonna end like 15 minutes until but my anxiety is kicking up and I'm afraid that I'm not gonna have everything ready by the time I have to go deliver that bread loaf to our friend at, at Soriana so um, yeah I have to go deliver that and I'm afraid I might miss them so I will see you guys Tuesday. All right. So for the weekend, we've got 
plus or minus Vampire Masquerade. I'm not quite sure if we're actually doing it. I was thinking, I saw this like message hell, but if you're here, maybe we can like still like show up and see if we have any like surprise guests that want to actually join. And if not, maybe we'll just have to talk to Darth and figure out what to do from there. Ow. Um, so that's Saturday. Sunday I have my bake sale. I might be around because I wanted to start getting back on some things. Mostly like Warframe and Gilbert, like Gilbert's 2 stuff. Start working on some guides. I need to do that. And then Mondays are my recoup times. That's like my only day that I don't do shit. So I don't even do laundry on Mondays. I don't even do dishes on Mondays. So that's my Mondays. I don't do crap. So, but yeah. Um, yeah, I hope you guys have a good day or a good weekend, I should say. I mean, day wherever you are, but I hope you guys have a great weekend. I will see you guys on Tuesday for the next stream. And if you are involved with any of those other activities, hope to see you there. Until then, take care, stay safe. Bye-bye. That's it, man. Game over, man. It's game over. <laughs>